Yo, what's up friends? <clears throat> so I'm sitting here farting around in my garage getting ready to do some different types of fishing. Uh, so normally I still had fish till the cows come home and then that's it for me. So but this year what I want to do is I want to get into more trout fishing and I also want to get into more bass fishing, possibly pike fishing, uh, all on the fly rod. And what I got here is this really awesome stand-up paddle board from Boat and I have it's super awesome I have like a, a fishing fishing rack and all, all sorts of goodies that I throw on it but I'll show you shots of that later so what I want to do is I want to find places to drop that in I'm gonna start with Presque Isle here uh, and try to figure out how to do bass fishing uh, on the fly rod here all right so what I've rigged up here is I had this old oh, there you go. I had this old like pike and musky leader and at the end of it they had this this little wire here so you can see that and it's all shot to pieces so i just cut that off and i also put a a little swivel a little micro swivel on it and the reason why i did that is because when you're out there casting and if there's any wind it usually sends your fly twirling gets all twist up and you easily get wind knots so this should help me prevent any wind knots all right so got this monster box full of different flies some of these flies I bought years ago, thinking I was gonna go crush it. Like, look at this guy, the man bear pig. Thinking I was gonna go crush it on that. And I haven't caught a single fish on this thing. Who knows, maybe it's all changed soon. Oh yeah, and the uh, dragon tail. Cool, I like it. Swims nice. I haven't caught a fish on it yet though. This guy on the other hand, I've caught a fish on this before and this one I'm gonna be using on my seven white here. Let me get that tied up. Oh, I might use this guy too. We'll see. We'll see. All right. And these, these forceps that uh, Yankee John gave me, they're the bomb. Look at this. Cut right through. Wire right. So awesome. So here's what I rigged up from uh, some other rigs I have. So I have uh, about two feet of wire bite. In the offhand chance, I hook into a, a pike. I'm going to need that so it doesn't break my line instantly. And then down here, I have a little clasp so that I can easily just whoop, whoop, switch out different flies. And I think that's going to work. And then <laughs> it's like a makeshift. Uh, this is a perfection loop. I just kind of, you know, rigged it up there. It's probably not the best idea, but it works. We'll see what happens here. So I, again, we have wire bite, about two feet of that, to this micro swivel, which should help with uh, preventing wind knots. And... Then I have this old uh, pike leader, and that runs all the way to the fly line, and it's tapered too, so nice big fat butt section tapers down. I don't know what pound test here, it's still pretty heavy, but that should, should work out. Let's go ahead and throw this guy on, so this clasp, should just pop on, there you go. And I should just swim around. Mmm. That's going to be good bass eating. I'm also going to rig up my Helios 5 weight 9 foot uh, H3D and my Mirage LT Reel so that I can do some, some light top water action. So I'll throw like a little popper on this and uh, see what we can do, what type of top water action we can get. All right, so for my 5 weight setup, I just got a normal tapered trout leader. <laughs> on this we go to about 5x tip it i have a little tip it ring there but then i have just 5x at the end of it and that's what i'm gonna use for some top water action should be fun to throw and see this little guy a little chartreuse floating stimulator here Woo. should be a lot of fun What's up friends? Time for a little bass fishing on the paddle board here. Got all rigged up and uh, gonna check out how well we can do. So I spent a few hours out there turning through flies, different presentations, different spots. So I am new at this, so it's not surprising that I wasn't that successful, but man, it is frustrating. A little five weight for some top water action here. I wanted to try it out. 
I think. And these lilies, probably a decent spot. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> right back out there. Got him. What is he? Oh, look at that little. Look at that little guy. Allergied up my top water. Action. Let's get him again. Look at that. What was that? What was that? Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, yeah. Where are you going? Where are you going? Holy moly. Little bluegill. Little bluegill. What's up, dude? Oh, oh. Pike. That was a massive pike just swiped at him. I don't know if you could see that. <laughs> But oh my gosh. There's a pike just sitting right under him. Trying to get him. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, he's trying to eat my bluegill. Let's see if he'll eat him. I'm coming back. Coming back for that pike. That pike was so huge. I'm gonna come back for him. Oh yeah. Look at this beautiful little guy. See you later, little bud. <laughs> okay. Watching that pike tells me I might actually be able to get some out of here. So I'm going to try it. A little quick switch here. I'm so anxious for that pike. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, what am I doing? There we go. Got a fly box in the cooler. There's one. Got a fish. I don't know what it is. But I gotta get my line under control. What? What? Dude. These guys are pigs. Absolutely pigs. Give me that back. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, bass. Got something. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What we got? What we got? What we got? What do we got? Uh-oh. We got caught up on something. Nope, nope, not anymore. There we go. There we go. Oh, got a bass. Woo-hoo-hoo. -hoo. What's up, little buddy? Oh yeah, first bass of the day. Not a tank by any means, but still beautiful. Let me hang out for a sec. All right, just trying to slide into a spy here. It's this one for a moment. Get a few casts out here. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? <laughs> Oh yeah, bass. <laughs> Look at this little guy. Oh man, that was fun. 
Yeah, buddy. Catch you later. <laughs> Yo, what's up? So, I definitely need more practice here. Um, I struggled today, truth be told. Uh, put a few, <laughs> few bass in the net. They weren't giant by any means. Put a couple sunfish in the net. Uh, but, pfft, I definitely got to get a lot better. I saw some pike. Oh, man. Um, I wish I could have triggered some bites there, but I did not. So, I don't know. I got a ways to go. If you haven't yet, definitely subscribe. Hit the little notification bells because I'm going to be posting lots more videos to come.